Hi, everyone. I've had a few questions uh, from people looking for other ways of creating screencasts. Um, obviously, um, for things like uh, Screencastify uh, do limit you to a short amount of time. Um, I've already recorded a screencast in terms of how to use Google Meet to do this. Um, however, you can also get a really good quality recording out of Zoom. And uh, just to show you how to do this, I'm just going to go ahead and open up my Zoom account. Um, I do have a licensed account, but you don't need a licensed account to do this. All I'm going to do is just start my uh, meeting as I normally would. So go ahead and click New Meeting, and you can see that um, I'm now on my, uh, my Zoom meeting. Uh, sure, I'll join with the computer audio. And then what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to click Record, and Record will save this to your local desktop. And so if I hit Record, um, it's recording now. Um, obviously, I want to do this as a screencast, so I don't want to just have myself on the screen. So what I'm going to do instead is I'm going to go hit the share button and I'm going to choose one of the uh, windows that I would like to uh, record. So I'm going to actually record my entire desktop. So I'll hit share. And just like that, you can see I do have a thumbnail of myself. I can minimize that if I want to. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and just bring it down here. But again, this is recording what's on my screen, which includes everything here. So now uh, you can see that I'm on the staff learning link. I can maybe direct people to some of the teaching and learning online resources and some of the videos and uh, tutorials there, uh, maybe into the screencast and how to videos, which I'm guessing you guys all know because you're watching this video. Um, and as soon as I'm done, I uh, can actually just go right back to, uh, to zoom by, you can see this little panel up at the top. I can uh, stop my, uh, or sorry, stop the share by just pushing this little red button right here. And as soon as I do, I'm back on the big screen. And all I need to do to get this ready to send is just push the stop recording button. And now um, it's telling me that it'll be saved to a uh, MP4 when the meeting ends. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, just go into my Zoom and click the end meeting. And it doesn't matter, I'm all by myself, so it doesn't matter, I end it for all. It immediately starts telling me that it's uh, converting that video. And that's it. Um, it will uh, give you the video to upload to YouTube. To find it, all you need to do is go into your meeting section of Zoom. And you can see that there's an upcoming or recorded section. If I go to the recorded section, I can, uh, I can see that I have a recording from me or March 25th, um, it does give me the, the path where I can find it. It uh, will actually um, uh, direct you to it. I can go open and um, you'll see that it gives me the folder that contains that video. Um, and uh, so I can take that and upload it directly to YouTube. Um, I hope that helps. Um, if that one's clear as mud, do let me know, and I'm more than happy to, uh, to give you a hand.